beautiful people, my name is Nistaku and welcome back to Wolf Among Us. We have lots and lots to do because now we're starting episode 4. And then after episode 4 is episode 5. Oh, I don't think I've seen this yet. Oh, look at the little blood. Oh, okay. All right. Episode 5 is going to be crazy. Episode 4 seems like it's going to be drama filler. We'll see. Um, even then, like the, what is it? Like the next. If you can't afford to look human, oh. you're going to the farm. It's as simple We're as that. We're not taking him to the farm. Do you how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? <laughs> it just sounds like, it looks like he's mirror. smiling the entire time. Crane must have taken a shard with him. Oh. The open arms. Yeah. Enjoy your stay. If you had just waited for me to explain before telling Beast. Big B? How could you do this to me? Yeah. I guess I finally see you for who yeah, you Yeah, because th this don't is you important. Just tell me who did it. I know you know. I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? Obviously not. Oh, that's what matters. Did her sitting, standing there all sinister like in the back? It's, oh. We didn't kill Dom though. Yes, that's what we need to see. We're good. And then we die. But, you know. Just take him, okay? Take Crane. With the little music? It doesn't sound what right. Beautiful relationship we have with you guys. Okay. Really? Yeah. yeah, we already saw this. Yeah. Didn't realize we had to replay it. In with the new. Long live the queen. Jeez. Awful. Awful. But, uh, I don't know. I think, what was it? In the next time on? It just didn't look as um, as action packed as they normally do, so I wouldn't be surprised if this is just for more lore dumping. Oh, what? Oh, hey! <laughs> See you around. Oh, he's having nightmares. <clears throat> Hollow point bullets are a Jeez. nasty business. The silver slug deformed and shredded on impact. Oh, he'll be okay though. Hmm? He'll be okay. His internal organs are positively riddled. Are you wearing gloves? If I don't extract every single scrap of silver, he's liable to suffer some long-term toxicosis. <sighs> Easy there. Come on, I mean, uh, jeez. <clears throat> Ew. Oh, baby. Oh! <laughs> you can't keep moving this way, old boy. I figured I'd be done uh, before you. What happens to me? Am I going to be okay? But there's little I can do for the pain. Am I going to be okay? Just stay still and let me finish. Swinehart, how bad is it? No, not the worst I've seen, but damn near it. Oh. I must say, you're testing even my skills here. Ew! Ah, Please, stop it! Don't move it, doctor. Look, I'm a bit engaged saving his life at the moment. But if the fractured extremity concerns him that much, he can set it himself. <laughs> okay. Yep. Yeah, you put, you put it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We just, uh. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh, yep. Oh. <laughs> Did we not do it? Oh, hey, Colin. Hey. Oh, my gosh. All right. Yep. Mm -hmm. Move the arm back over. Surgery time. Uh, chiropractor. Nope, that's for the back. Uh, 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 the bone doctor, Big B Wolf. Back for business. Oh. All right. Easy. All better. Don't even need an Advil. Hmm. Not bad. That'll do, I suppose. Thanks. He's lucky to be alive. And he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. He didn't listen to me <laughs> before. Maybe he'll listen to you. I don't know about that. You think I wanted this? This is well, the job. You I can there hear are you. to what even I can do. I don't know. Just gonna keep quiet. Please tell me you have gloves on. <laughs> is sepsis not a thing for uh, wolves? Excuse me, Miss White, but perhaps it'd be better <laughs> if you gave me a few minutes to finish with him. I don't know why. She just kind of hovered over. I, I think I should stay at least until he's. Out of the woods. I'm always in the woods, baby. Couldn't be in better hands. Stick around, all right? I'll be fine. Don't look so snow. All right, she's a big freaking girl. Stick around. Appreciate the headroom. Stick around, all right? 
I don't know if I trust this guy. Oh yeah, totally. Oh, please, I could do this with my optic nerves severed. We'll be done in a moment. Just please, give us the time. He wants to talk to us about something, I bet. Push her away that hard. Hey, Colin. Hey, Doc. How much longer? Colin, leave him be. Oh, no. It's finished when it's finished. Because I once watched a vet sew a turtle together in ten minutes flat. <laughs> Colin, how? I'm not even That's supposed to be here right now. Oh, really? Where uh, am I supposed to be? man. I'm here to take and he care quiet, of my calm, friend. Shut up. With what? Your hooves? Hey, listen, Please, lady. Keep it down back uh, there. Don't distract, don't distract. Thank you. Could you please not distract the doctor while he has my chest cut open? Yes, that would be helpful. Yikes. <sighs> there. All done. How do you know? Great. This isn't a habit you should keep to. Having visits with me. And, well, this time. Wow. My gauze went a long no way. Joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Ah, <sighs> dang. Yes, sir. Miss White. He'll be fine for light duty, if he can figure out what that means. <laughs> he knows what it means. It's just been an unusual couple of days. I know, but please, don't give him the excuse. His body will eventually. Are you just gonna up. walk out with blood all over yourself? Take care of him, please. Jeez, I will. my poor seating. He'll need rest, I assume. Don't need babysitter right here. Post. She has enough on our plate. Just keep watch and make sure he doesn't get into further just altercations. Just be silent. I'll try. If she wants to do it, there's no reason to push her away. Anyways, guard against, as they say. Miss White, Sheriff. Oh, he was wearing Colin. gloves. Swiney. Oh, a little bit of tea there. They don't like each other? Maybe they're brothers? No, that wouldn't make sense. Yummy! So, Apple juice! How do you, um, feel? I feel like I've been cut it's open. It's Bigby, Snow. It's good, it's good. He'll don't be worry okay. Uh, Hell, don't I worry about me. Worse. Don't worry about me, alright? <laughs> I'll be fine. The back See, shot. strong as an oak, this guy. Snow, go change or something. You had us. <clears throat> you had us worried there for a while. You, uh, you stopped breathing, you know, when you passed out or, uh, uh. or died, I guess. Well, that's fun. Why do you want to touch me? Hello. That's my broken arm. It, um, it kind of scared the hell out of me. Are we dating? I've never Not seen so you. I'm here like for you. That. And when you really Swinehart worried? arrived, you uh, know him. He's never worried. Uh, and even he thought you were- I'm here for you! Snow, I'd never leave you. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you were really fucked up, uh, hey, Colin. You look like when you take an action figure and bend its limbs the wrong way. Thanks, Colin. Colin. I'm just saying, I was worried about him is all. The guy hasn't had a night's rest in days. Well, I'll get some rest when this whole thing is done. What whole thing? What's even happening out there? I mean, do you guys have like a plan or something? And who should I be asking? We need to get Crane Snow to can decide what's best. This is a bigger thing now. This is a bigger thing now. The Crooked Man, Bloody Mary, yeah. the Tweedles. This is bigger this than is what massive. I thought it was. Yeah. It's like a, the what do you call it? A came mob? Out of the shadows Mafia? Forums. Mafia. For him to attack us so blatantly like that. He either feels invincible or desperate. Well, if those are my two options, I don't think I'd pick desperate. Oh, what do you mean? You traded Crane to save Bigby. I'm just saying, that's not exactly something you do when you're playing with house money. To surrender. So he called my bluff. It's not like I'm gonna let Bloody Mary just murder. Um, thanks for saving yeah, me. Uh, thanks, Snow. She totally would have killed us. There. No problem. Thanks. You're not pissed that Crane's flown the coop? I don't think Crane's the main the issue. You aren't there, of course. I'm snow on the dude, she had you. We're all mad about Some it, piss. Colin. But it's not we like there. we have a strong choice in the matter. You weren't there, Colin. So just drop it. Okay, okay. All I care about right now is... Just what does the crooked man want out of this? Money? I thought he was just a loan shark. But clearly, he's operating in other circles. It can't just be about Crane, right? Getting him out of town? 
Is this all about the murders? Victims are my concern. They Crane made the wrong enemy. Crane was him I think Crane was used. So he was used for the money laundering. Faith and Lily? Crane was a puppet. And the crooked man worked the strings. This is all about control of Fabled Town. Yeah, I think but that. But then what do prostitutes anything? have to do with it? Lily? And Faith? I have no idea. I don't idea. know how it all works out yet, but I know it does. Somehow. The crooked man declared war against us last night. At least that's what I thought when it happened. But now I see this war has been going on for years. We just haven't noticed it because our way of doing things is broken. Yep. We need to do things the right way. Yep. What does that mean? The right way. What do you think I know? Oh no. I don't Dream know. Here, I but it suspiciously sounds like you're Oh gosh. Bigby's the one on the front lines. Okay. What do you, you mean? You can't give him a leash. He doesn't work that way. Yeah. Wait, what do you mean? What is this right way? I just I'm asking We haven't been doing a good job. You and I. What have I been doing? I've been doing everything nice. I have not so, killed anyone. Starting now, we do everything cut and dried, by the book, straight as an arrow. Pure as driven snow. I'm not saying I'm the arbiter of- Sure you're not. Oh. <laughs> this town has enough monsters. What happened last night, what you turned into, it can't happen again. Obviously. We need monsters. The Easy fight to monsters. Say, Colin, you're right, I, really I had no other choice. I had no- him to lose Did you see how he got shot notice? up beforehand? You're under attack, Snow. What did you expect me to do? There are degrees. Okay, degrees. yes, Snow. I only ever do what's necessary. Really? Do you believe him? Yeah, I do. Let's go! Look, Bigby, I care about how this is done just as much as I care about it getting done. So for that, you want to give him a handicap? Like the bad guys will worry if shit gets sloppy. Everybody wants Bigby oh, to smile man. and shave and take a shower sloppy. now and then. Call Hell, I'm practically the president of the Bigby Don't Be Such a Dick Club. <laughs> but this is the wrong fucking quiet. time to put shackles on it. I agree. He'll get the job done. Just let him do it. I'm going to... I'm going to let you do it, okay? Thank you. It's just that now that I'm deputy mayor, I need your respect. You're telling me I haven't respected you this entire time? And this situation has to end. What situation? Uh -uh. All unglamored fables starting today have to go and stay at the front. Oh, yeah, give me a fucking break. No. The answer is no. Are you gonna let her talk to me like that? Snow's in charge. I'm not enforcing that. The farm is awful right now. We need to fix the, the farm keeps everybody and then bring people there. That's not gonna happen. Yes, it will. No, it won't. It's an impossible rule to enforce, Snow. You really expect to round up every talking cat and raven in town? There's not that many stragglers left, except the one or two you make excuses for. The farm is awful. We've already established that, that it's not being taken care of at all. It's a Wolf's horrible residence. place to send people. That's we need to fix rude. it first. Oh, Buffkin, what is it? Okay, I'll let him know. Thanks. Guess who's waiting in your office right now? It's not you. Narissa. Narissa? Oh. That broad from the pudding and pie? Rude. Yes. Apparently, she told Buffkin that she has something she needs to talk to you about. But that she'll only tell you. And what do you think that could be? Uh, None of your business, no, because we're you in a tense well relationship the, right now. Uh, disenfranchised. Uh, she probably knows something. Something about your prickly demeanor attracts him no like a moth to a flame. I haven't the slightest. She has a spell okay. casted on her. I should get back to the business office. I've left Buffkin alone for too long taking calls. And I should probably change out of these clothes. No, you should keep them. Looks great. Consider the discussion tabled, but not over. Yeah, no. Let me know when you're done with Nerissa. How about you fix aye, the farm aye, first? Captain. Deputy She's Mayor. She's a piece of work. Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? Not until we fix the farm. I mean... She do seems real serious about change it, but I can still hang out here, right? Look, uh, maybe a few will get sent up, but you're my friend, Colin. I wouldn't do that to you. Don't worry about it. Thanks, Bigby. I don't... You chose friendship over the rules. No! It's just like, are we just forgetting that the farm is absolutely untaken care of because Crane has been ignoring it for months, if not years? Is that the farm? 
that's just like it's not a smart idea to just send more people when it's already in bad shape we need to take care of the people there and then add more people hello oh okay <laughs> what why We're, oh, can i skip please please oh, i can only pause it all right well I truly wonder why they feel like I need this intro every single time. What? I'm playing Wolf Among Us? No. No, this is- this- this is Wolf Among Us? No way. No. No way. You know what? I think we're playing Wolf Among Us, guys. We may be on episode 4, but I think- I think this is a game. I thought it was Walking Dead for a while. Episode 4. In sheep's clothing. Okay. Hey, girl. Hi. Hi. Jeff. You can't Hi, literally Marissa. talk, so what do you want to talk about? Have a seat. No. Bog- bog- got bog- what kind of drink is that? FBI wanted. Robbery investigation. Wow, my office is great. Mm -mm -mm. Yummy. I, um, are you okay? Oh, you know what? She probably feels guilty. You didn't look good last night. Yeah, I, mean, I wasn't sure you see the other guys. You, you know, around. I'm better. Well, let's just say I've been better. <laughs> Picture of someone in Central Park. Oh yeah, let's smoke it up. Oh yeah. Oh, that's what's up. Huff and puffs. <laughs> Not many people smoke those. Sure, right? It's funny. Let's hear it. What did Crane want with you? So what brings you here? Thanks. So what is it you wanted to talk to me about? Oh, you see? <laughs> I know what you did for me. In the back, Sending you see Lily. Not orders. Lily. Um, her sister, you Holly. Help. You see Holly yeah. in the woods. That's funny. There's not a lot that I can talk about. You know that. So that spell Crane was trying to break. It's not just while you're at work, huh? What did you want to talk about, ma'am? What I mean is, I don't want to waste your time, but I don't want you wasting your own time either. Okay. Back in the dressing room, at the pudding and pie, I told you what I was looking for, and you found a way to tell me. That's what you she- sent me to the open arms. That's what she's kind of doing now, work though. again. You can try. I just- Um... Go ahead. Give more crane. Was crane set up? It- might work. The Crooked Man? You're here because the Crooked Man just sent Crane to the bottom of my list of worries. You have something you want to say about that, right? These lips are sealed. I wonder if she's if forced to say that. Just like that. I wouldn't have had to make that appointment with you. No. I guess oh, not. man. Okay. Just, just give me what you- Sometimes, we have to find our way through life on our own. Grasping and fumbling in the dark. I... I used to have friends to help me find my way. But now... They're gone. And I don't know what to do. Hmm. You trust me. Where is this going? No. This is about Faith and Lily. Are you trying to say something about Faith and Lily? She's just gonna what say- What I'm saying is friends matter. And I, I don't have any left. Hmm. So I hope you're looking after yours. Are you? Oh, uh, should I suspect my friends? Look around you. Uh, Who are you talking I, about? This is not helping. These answers, she, he's not getting it. <sighs> I'm sorry. I thought I could do this. I need you to know... I want to help. This is hard. We can't snap at her. But your lips are sealed. But your lips are sealed. Yeah. She's under a spell. We can't do anything about it. She's guilty and wants to try. I'm sorry if I'm wasting your time. I thought I knew how to say it. Ribbons. Faith wore one too, huh? Do you like it? 
Mm-hmm. I'm trying to help you. Do you? It's a tool of control. It's not about how it looks. It's a tool of control. How can I? It's a tool to keep you stuck in that life. Subservient. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? Can she, like, do, like, a symbol where it's, like, blink once for yes, twice for no? Is that possible? Uh-uh! Oh, no. Oh, no. No? Can we just... No, no. Any way to break this spell? That spell Crane talked about. Is there any way to break it? Is there something I can do about it? No! Whoa! Put your field. Stop. What? You can't. Just stay back. Yeah. You can't do that. Slow down. It's all right. I'm not gonna do anything. Seriously. That's that's how Please. both of the Lily Don't. and Faith have um had that same <sighs> way of dying. And Faith had her ribbon okay. in her mouth, so I think it's from the I ribbon. Get it. So the ribbons, if you take them off. Yeah, you kind of go, uh, come for her, I'll fix this, I'm sorry. Come for her. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to scare you. Gosh, you're so skinny. Would you like a Big Mac? If anyone finds out I came here. Oh, okay. It's probably snow. Listen, Sheriff. What's that? Can you keep this conversation between us? We didn't really talk about much. I could be in a lot of trouble. Yeah, what are you afraid of? We know what she's afraid of. Please. I'm gonna say sure. Don't tell anyone. Don't worry. We didn't really talk about much, you know. Thank you. You were just telling me to look after my friends. <laughs> hey. <laughs> uh, nothing happened. Sorry. I just need to talk to the sheriff for a moment. Please excuse us. Excuse me, girl. I might have a new lead for you, but I don't know how solid it is. Beauty and Beast called the office just now. They said they wanted to talk to you about something. I wonder if they've heard about Crane. Oh. Thank you for listening, Sheriff. You should go on to your next business. I don't think you'll be wasting your time. Hey, wait, you don't have to go. Okay, so I think that was definitely telling that us to was... go to... Abrupt. She wants us to go to Beauty and Beast. I might have sent a message. What did she tell you? I didn't mean to rush Um. You did you get anything from her? We already knew this. Magic keeps her from talking. She couldn't really say anything. Yeah. The magic that Crane was talking about, it's in the ribbon. And you can't take the ribbon off. Or... It's how Faith and Lily died. There you go. There you go. Piece that together, okay, Wolf. Good work. <laughs> I'm a good boy. So, about Beauty and Beast, do you think there's something to it? Is this the right place to look? How Marissa just left man? like that? Or do you think they just heard you, about they last night? Us for a and they're she just pointed us there. Come on, been don't going be daft. On. That's what Narissa was doing, telling us to go there. I think she made it as clear as she could have. Narissa's smart. Hmm. She's trying her best, man. You know, Beauty came to me a while back. Yeah. She was looking for financial assistance. I told her there was nothing I could do, and and she said that meant she'd have to go somewhere else. Yep. Nice job, Snow. Bigby, you don't think she meant that she was going to go to the Crooked Man, do you? Oh no, I that know that. Would explain why they called. We need to solve this before something else happens. Who knows what? Oh, well, maybe that's what Narissa was getting at with your, uh, watch your friends, because Big B I and Beauty are- other matters are not to B, attend Beauty. to. Beauty and Beast are our friends. Like, all the ones that are close to us, that aren't, like, fully, um, I guess, servants to the Crooked Man. Kind of like half and half. That's the, uh... And you didn't want to tell me oh? what you were into either. Good reason. Oh, what great. Happened? Oh, great. <laughs> I don't open the door. Knock. What is wrong with Big B? Hello. <laughs> hey. Oh, it's you. You called me. What are you doing here? You called. <sighs> What's this about? You called. You called, right? Or uh, was it Beast? I didn't call you. Listen, 
I've had a shitty night. Well, you're not the only one. Oh, really come on, Beauty. Really? This is like, I didn't do There's anything no to you. called and wanted to talk to me. If someone called, it must have been Beast. I certainly didn't. I heard Beast okay. in there. I... You know, if you had just kept your mouth shut about me, Beast wouldn't have lost his head over the open Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He never yeah, yeah, would yeah. have even found the place. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I wouldn't have had to spend the night defending myself for keeping secrets with Bigby Wolf. Poor you. I lost my job because of you. I needed that. No, you lost your job because of Beast. Because you and Beast fought. That is not Judy? me. Can I talk to Beast? Who is it? Can I talk to Beast? If you don't want to talk, can you just get Beast for me? I don't know. Talking has a way of escalating with you. Oh, Beauty, I cannot stand you. Wow. Big B's here. Hi, Big B. Can you give us a minute? Yep. All right. A word in private? I think that's a good idea. Yeah, yeah, you guys keep arguing. This is so great. This is so professional. Mm. I guess I really do have the smallest apartment in the woodlands. No. Beauty, let's not make a problem out of this. What's he doing here? Oh, no. I don't want to bother them. We really need to bring Big B into this. We've talked um, about it already. Let's look around, I guess. I, that's so mm. pretty. Talk about living in the past. Situation. Well, that's what we're going to find Man, they out. probably miss it. I know Life was easy true, back then mo for them. Keep a little secret. How can we Ooh. trust him with this? Don't do that. Why would you do that? Why are you so you dense? Do. Whatever. We... It's not just that. Go. Trouble follows him around. We're out Trouble follows him around. I can hear you guys. I have so big can hearing. Can I? Matter? What? Okay. Not you know what? Big I'll here, big, big, figure out how to go over there, please. Go on. Oh. What is wrong with you? Why do you like doing that? Oh. Hello. Sorry. We've had a long night. Yeah. Good. What's that you always say? Can we? Centuries of marriage come with centuries of baggage. Yep, okay. Um, I gotta say, your place, it looks, uh, expensive. It's beautiful. That's What's what we mean. What's that supposed to mean? Nothing. It's Beauty. beautiful. What? It's a fair question. Aren't you in He's debt? the sheriff, not an interior decorator. So, what are you trying to say? Aren't you in I debt? thought you were having money problems, but it doesn't look like you're suffering to me. Is this something about that loan you took out from the crooked man? That's part of it, but we can't bring him into this. He's just going to make things worse. He always Beauty. does. Well, he's here now. Beauty, shut Let's see up. What can do. Why are you being I like you. this? I'm just trying to do what's you. best for I want to help. I'd like to help you, but I can't do anything if you don't tell me what's we going on. Let's be so patient with these two. Just answer me this first. What's up? What if we did have some information on the crooked man? If we talk, we're putting ourselves at risk. Could you protect us? Oh, I've seen injured. what happens when you cross him. Can you- Can you promise you'll keep us safe if we talk? Yes. I can protect you, but only if you tell me what I need to know. And that means details. No more stonewalling. We're, we're not. Yeah, okay. Then just tell me what's going on here. You get used to a certain way of doing things, and sometimes it just gets away from you. I just I get wanted that. to give Beauty the kind of life she deserves. Aww. You understand that, don't you? And there's not a lot of work out there. What do Who you do for work? would we be if we just lived like... Um... <laughs> Maybe I should A day at the beach? Um... Skiing the slopes? <laughs> and we can't come hey, to the phone right we're now. Not done so leave a message at the I beach should... and we'll get back to you as soon as <laughs> <laughs> humanly possible. Beep! My gosh. That fucking message. I'm gonna come down there and bash your heads in with that machine if I have to call again and hear that fucking message one more time. I've been doing this long enough to know that if you had the cash, you'd have paid by now. Who is that? You consider yourselves out of warnings. It's time to start thinking about how else you can settle this. Because next time, I'm making a house call. What the hell did you get yourselves into? Whoa. The crooked man's gonna get his. One way or another. Oh! Bro. You war guys are in it deep. 
All I care about is, how can I find the Crooked Man? Who do I talk to? Where do I go? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, please. Please. Oh, oh, they're loving each other. Oh. The Lucky Pawn. That's where I borrowed the money. The Crooked Man's behind that place. Okay. I'd overheard people talking to Jersey about loans before. So, when I needed money, that's where I went. I didn't know what to do. You could have told Who's me. Who's Jersey? Wait, who do you deal with? Jersey. You know, the Jersey Devil. Oh yeah, that slimy prick. Ugh. I didn't realize he was back on this side of the river. And those Tweedles were always going in and out. Probably dropping off a loan payment they squeezed out of some poor fable. That's so sad. But never the crooked man. Mainly it's just regular fables. I can see now that it was a mistake, but I'm not the only one who goes there, you know. Okay. I saw the woodsman's axe there just the other day. It was in a display case. I guess he's hit hard times, yeah, no, too. This case, There's a lot of that going there. around. You already know why. I can't imagine he has a lot of marketable skills. What can Bloody Mary must go through there? She had Woody's axe last night, trying to chop my damn head off with it. Maybe if you go there, you can sort some things out. I guess I'll go check out the Lucky Pawn. If I can't track down the Crooked Man there, maybe I can make enough noise that the Crooked Man will come find me. Hold on, Bigby. Don't go there. Sounds like you're just going to get Beauty in trouble. And... I need to go there. I know you're being protector you know over here. butcher shop, the cut above? Um. It's the place on Tubman Street. Same block as the baker and the candlestick maker. The baker and the well, candlestick I've maker? Been oh, delivering I know that. Packages from there for a while. The thing is, it's for the crooked man. Okay. And I don't think it's meat in the packages. <gasps> what are you doing? You gotta understand. I need it work. What are you, you have delivering? To believe us. Well, what are you delivering? What's going on there? How does this fit into the crooked man's operation? I couldn't tell you, but I do know this. It's the only meat market in town that doesn't carry fillet. I'm not sure how much actual butchery what? goes on there. What? Okay. How did you get involved what? with this? Johan the butcher called. He had a problem with the refrigeration unit one night. But when I finished, it was your pal Mary who showed up to pay me. She said I was reliable. She liked that. And it's the only thing I've been able to pick up. Mary always there. still not enough. I don't want beauty to I have help to work. Quit. Especially you do their dirt. Oh, come on, stop. It's Mary you deal with? Bloody Mary is there? No, Johan is the one who hands over the packages, you know, day to day. But I've seen her around there. She, uh, gets under my skin, you know? I I try to avoid her. Oh, well, that's what but you should do. I don't do. need to tell you what she's You're like. damn right you don't. Oh, I don't no. Need her okay. Her no need to get angry. If Mary works out of there, I need to look into it. No, you're not thinking right. You're thinking out of vengeance. I just wanted to provide for beauty. Give her the kind of life she deserves. That's true. They love each other. We shouldn't have to live like this. I'm scraping to get by. I know. None of us should. You guys are royalty. I know. We were royalty once. <laughs> yep. We were accustomed to a certain lifestyle. Oh, yep. All we want is to make this place feel a little bit like home. You guys need to learn you something called content. You wouldn't understand, Bigby. Probably not. Wow. Uh, I don't need to. Probably not. No. Probably not. Let's be nice. No reason to tell him to frick off. So, where are you going? I'm not going to no butcher. If this all goes sideways. I'd like to know where it's coming from. We literally just got a live threat from the call about the Jersey Devil visiting you guys if you don't call again. The only thing that the butcher shop has for us is that, oh, every now and then, Bloody Mary's there. That's not enough for me. We're going to Lucky Pond. That is I'm the biggest. Going to the Lucky Pond. Yeah. There's too much going on there to ignore. I'll have a word or two with Jersey. You know, Bigby, once you show your face there, word is going to get out. There may be nothing left to see if you go to the butcher shop after. Well, I guess I'll find out. It's no different. It's not. I, I don't care Wait. enough. I don't know what you're planning to do when you find the Crooked Man, but. Is there any way you could help us out? How much more help do you need? What do you mean? Well, maybe you can make this all just go away. We would really appreciate <laughs> it. 
What do you say? Uh, they want us to Can kill him. You help us out? I'll figure it out. I'll handle it. I'm not gonna let that crooked bastard ruin any more lives. Really? Oh, thank you, Big B. I'm sure you'll do the right thing. Yeah, don't don't insinuate to killing him anymore, guys. It's okay. I got it. I, I got the hint the first time. Can you make this all go away? Alright, wait, uh, 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 uh. wait, did it save? I want to make sure it's saved. Did it save? I'm assuming it's saved. Okay. <laughs> Let's go to the Book of Fables. We will leave it there. Yeah, because I we're only, like, interested to go to the butcher shop because, oh, I saw Mary there once. And we're not here to try to, like, catch a vengeance hit on Mary. We're here to get information and to protect our people. <laughs> Why am I so yawny? Okay. Book of Fables. Here we go. We unlocked... Wow. I unlocked the very last thing. And two things in the beginning. Sure. Let's go to the last one. Life on the farm. Oh, that was the farm. Okay. Oh, it kind of looks nice. I thought it would be like an actual farm. Well, I guess they have to house the people. Whatever. Uh, with its id idyllic? What? Location and managed community. The farm would seem to be a welcome alternative to Eking? What are these words? Out in existence in Fable Town. But those who have lived there see it very differently. They see it for what it is a prison, a place where you are free to be who you are and do whatever you please, except leave. It doesn't help that while fables who appear human do not have to worry about being sent to the farm, they always seem to fill they always seem to fill the leadership roles there. That's not fair at all, because then you don't know what you're experiencing. Uh, silver bullets, wolf's weakness. The legend of the great magical wolves often make mention of their weakness against weapons made of silver, and those tales bear out to be true. The silver bullet Mary shot Bigby with was not the first, but any of them could be his last. Any silver left in Bigby bo Bigby's body weakens his system, slows his healing, and can cause long-term damage. Jeez. Oh, look at that. In her nice little chair. Acting Deputy Snow White. With Ichabod Crane firmly out of the picture and King Cole still absent, the task of leading Fable Town falls squarely on Snow's shoulders. She has performed many of the job's duties for a long time, picking up the slack for Crane. But now, she's fully in charge of the business office. She has to deal with a new level of politicking and she had not previously been exposed to. I hope Snow does better and actually answer all those letters cause poor Pinocchio out here splintering. <laughs> but I'm gonna leave it here. Um, I'm actually really excited to see what's gonna happen in the um, pawn shop. So I hope you guys have been enjoying it and just thank you so much for all the support that you bring on this channel. Um, yeah. I don't know. Just thank you guys so much. I appreciate you all dearly, and I'll see you next time. Have a blessed day, guys. Bye!